Local college hoops tonight, the Choctaws and Mississippi College at home. To bring in the New Year's, they continue conference play. MC at the AEB Coliseum taking the lead. Randy Bolden trying to get his team off to a good start in 2024. The Flames came out hot. Noah Bowler, Tyler goes up for the alley oop. That made it a 4-0 lead. St. Andrews product, shot Bolden. Answers with a three ball to get the Choctaws on the board. Uh, the Flames respond with a three of their own. Tim Vaughn hitting from the corner. Lee led by 12 at halftime. So Choctaws, they would have to rally, and they did. TJ Wallace out of Amory hits a three, and MC locks in. Bolden went crazy tonight. He had a game high. 35 points, a career high for him. His third 30-point game of the year propels the Choctaws to a 76-70 comeback win. Mississippi College improves to 6-4 in conference play. And in the women's game, the Choctaws have won three out of their last four, looking to keep it going against the Flames. And our MC trying to get separation from Lee Carly Ivy. It's a nice bank shot to end the third quarter. And the Choctaws are up by nine. She had 15 on the night. In the fourth quarter, Kaya Julian got hot. She hit a three and let the hand hang. Next possession, she hits another tray ball. She had eight points in the fourth quarter to push the Choctaws lead to double digits. MC, they win 70 to 64, a signature win for head coach Greg Long and the Choctaws as they down the Golf South lead, the, the Golf South leader and get their first ever win over the Leaf Flames. All right, some more local basketball this afternoon. The Bellhaven Blazers at home hosting LaGrange for a conference doubleheader to bring in the new year as well. The Bellhaven women's team looking for a 2-0 start to conference play. Steve Calder and the Blazers trying to take down the Panthers. Uh, Courtney Lee driving in the lane and create space for the nice teardrop shot. Blazers are up in front by two to start second half. After a miss, Zaya Johnson scores on a putback for the Panthers. She had a game high 25 points. The Blazers looking to respond, and Ebony Gaiden uses a strong move after the drive on the block and puts in two over 14 points. Bill Haven trying to rally after a big run by the Panthers. Tizetta Lomax out of Wingfield with the assist as Ashanti Lipscomb hits from outside. She led Bill Haven with 21 points, but it wasn't enough as LaGrange pulls away for a 95-74 win. Uh, Bill Haven now 1-1 in conference play. And after coming off a road win, the men's team had their first conference game of the season as they took on the Panthers at home. Uh, Samuel Moss for the visitors. He scores the first bucket of the game right from tip off as they take the early lead. But Jonathan Lucas out of Hartfield going to find Judah Jordan in the Mississippi College transfer where he would hit the three from long range. And this was a dynamic duo. Lucas had eight assists and he feeds Jordan with another dime. Jordan had 15 points in the game, but Moss and the Panthers were too much as he nails three of his 19 points after gathering the loose ball. Bill Haven, they fall short, 83-76. They're now 8-5 on the year. All right, we'll be back after this.